So, you want to mess with my computer still? I figured that. Is who is MWB trying to connect to my computer? Trying to, huh? Gotta love it. MWB. I'm gonna bust your balls. See that? MWB. I just unchecked it. As soon as I start having issues, it notice that. You keep it up. I'm glad that's working for you. And then, of course, I always got that hidden one that they want to keep. I got to undo. Because they like to do that hidden network. Hidden network. Yep. Secured hidden network. I'm glad that's working for you, stupid. Retarded. They are retarded. Let me tell you. I had to restart my car. My restart my computer because they were starting to mess around with it uh, retorts. they think they're funny but they're not so I guess because I one of us to this I have I didn't have a problem since I said something and my team is in overtime so I was watching trying to watch spirit garage Christmas thing football and study all at the same time I'm gonna forget because you know what I know the Sarah I know about the Sarah and what it is but now I'm throwing bl Joan blank oh she's delusional she's this she's that no you stole my freaking brain and I'm gonna prove it I'm gonna prove exactly what she's did to me because you want my fucking life you don't want me to be smarter than you scumbags. You want me to bring me down you wanna bring me down to your low life scumbag level. I'm glad that's worked for you. Okay, so we're going back to uh, I was talking about them pulling in everybody that I grew up with through the VFW. Back in let me tell you a story. Back in the beginning of 2014. Oh! Shit! Inner. My kids were saying, Why are you yelling at the TV? Oh my goodness. Come on, guys. Shit. So, anyway. So, back in 2014, I was saying how this girl, somebody was saying, Oh, you don't know what my brother is capable of. You don't know what my brother is capable of. Well, she's talking to another girl that I went to the VFW. Well, she was a little baby when I went to the VFW. She was just a baby. And I was, went to school with her sister, and her, her sister and I hung out during VFW convention stuff, during the VFW stuff. You know, like all our um, volunteer work. She was always there with it was me and a couple bunch of us that were always volunteering at the VFW or with the senior citizens and this and that so she's she was talking I had to I, I I print screened everything that I was talking because you know what they're all playing in this goddamn game this psychological crazy fucking bullshit game so that they can justify why they stole my children so my this my cousin goes Oh, you don't know what my brother's capable of. And then and then she's got to be mouth almighty. Be like, oh, can you help my cousin? Can you help my cousin out? Can you help her? Can you help her? To this other girl, Megan. Right? I'm glad that's working out for you fucking people. Excuse my language. But I'm going to pull all you people in that's messed with me for, for over the last umpteen months and years. And all you people that got recruited in, I'm going to mess, I'm going to mention. All the ones that got recruited, all the ones that are involved, 
and all the ones that are in charge of this stupid friggin mental bullshit game. For money. Greed. Yeah, that's working for you. I'm glad you have daughters that you can take to the princess, poppy princess contest. I'm glad you have daughters that you can take to the, to the pageants. Guess what? I had a daughter I took to a pageant. I'm sorry, she was only supposed to be here for a little while, and then she was supposed to be gone. She what? My. She was supposed to have drowned in water. That was what she was supposed to have done. My my premonitions and dreams were a bit. But because my ex-husband and I were worked really and we watched, kept a close eye on her around water because I had those bad feelings I had premonitions. So we watched her real closely around water. Well, obviously the Lord wanted her back. The Lord, she was only here for a little while to do her job to bring me and Alan together and that was that. Well, it, it, it kind of hurt us when she left. I call her, I say she left, she didn't. I always say she didn't die. I always say she left. But she's dead. She, you know. Anyway. Besides the point. She was only supposed to be here for a little while. To do her job. Well, she was done. My ex-husband and I were written ready to move forward in our life. And she was done. And she moved on. So. Shit! I don't even want to watch it no more. I'm done. Oh, they, they blew it. 49ers blew it the last overtime. Damn it. Oh, well. Fudge. That was a wide opening. Philly, all right. Praise be to God. But you know what? These people, my cousins, they're all going to have to start opening up their mouth and start talking truth. Because there are, there's too much shit flying around the fucking whole entire goddamn United States in this world. If somebody needs to open up their mouth. Because otherwise, guess what? I am. And you can try to say and pay off all kinds of asshole doctors to claim me crazy. But those asshole doctors are going to get their ass beat too. And you can have Dr. Kruger who's friends with the friggin' stupid ass bonos. And then pushing their way into everywhere else. Say, talk a bunch of shit too. But I'm going to talk, I'm going to talk straight. I'm going to be front. I'm going to be frank. Well, I'm not frank, but I'm going to be up front about everything. And I'm going to be honest, because that's me. You guys aren't, but I am. And you're going to go down for everybody I find out that you hurt in my past. Anybody you think you're going to put on for arson. Anybody you think you're going to put on for manslaughter. Anybody you think you're going to put on for assault. Anybody you think you're going to put on for harassment. Anybody you think you're going to get that I have loved and loved. Loved and lost in my life. Anybody that you want to recruit. They can re be, you can get, yeah, be recruited, Megan, and all you ass wipes. And anybody else you decide you guys are going to get recruited in. All you drug addicts. You can go back to jail, or you can get your ass to jail. Or you can go, or kill yourself. Especially you drug addicts. You are uh, drug addicts, stupid. Oh, I'll give you a way out. You want to better yourself? Here, all you got to do is this. No, it ain't happening. Not now, not now, not no more. You're either going to step up and say this isn't right, or get your ass to jail. But I'm done. I'm going to keep praising my Lord and Savior. And hope that I'm able to watch my Christmas show before I fall asleep because I'm tired. My husband, of course, is going to be up. 
Praise be to God, hope is in front of me.